Then God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw the light, that it was good. And God divided the light from the darkness. God called the light day, and the darkness He called night. So the evening and the morning were the first day. Usually, when people read this account of the first day, they think that God created the sun on this day. Since it says light, and the light on the earth right now is the light from the sun. So it is easy to think that God created the sun at this time. But this doesn't mean that God created the sun at that time. It says, God said, let there be light. The sun was already there, and the earth was only created later. So what is the light here? If we think of the earth in relation to the sun, the Bible says that God divided the light from the darkness. If He divided the light from the darkness in this way, on the side where the sun is shining, it's light here on the earth. If the division is like this, on this side it's broad daylight, and so there is evening and there is morning. And on the other side of the earth, it is night. So God divided the light from the darkness. And God called the light day. God called the light day. And the darkness He called night. This is what the Bible says. There was evening. The Bible always refers to the evening first. And there was morning. There was day and night and evening and morning. So what did God make on the first day? There was the earth in its original form, and day and night, and the evening and the morning made up the first day. That's what this means. If you look here, it says, Then God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw the light that it was good. And God divided the light from the darkness. God called the light day, and the darkness He called night. So the Bible is saying that on the first day, Day and night, and evening and morning came into being. 